On today's show, we all met Shanice. I love that man. I really do. She was completely in love with a man named Gary. Gary proposed to you, right? Yes. Have you accepted? I can't until I find out if he's been alive. But she believed Gary was secretly making love to someone very close to her. Her first cousin, Amber. <laughs> Shanice didn't like the way her cousin was dressing around her man. She walks around with these outfits. And one night she woke up to find them both missing. I couldn't find them for hours, Maury, hours. If he fails this test, what's going to happen? If he fails this test, he's out of my house today. <laughs> Gary came out and completely denied the affair. I would never mess yes, my girl. Yes, he did. He did, Maury. Maury. You he did. Get up the for several hours with Amber. Where'd you go? Oh, we took a smoke break, Mark. We just chilling oh, talking. Oh, I was smoke break. No, 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 no. Amber came out and completely denied the affair. And you took care of me, so why would I go behind your back and sleep with your Yeah, man? I took care of you and so did my man, too. It seems like we're getting the best of both worlds, don't it? The results of a lie detector test were in. Here we go, Gary. Have you had any type of sexual contact with Amber? You said no. The lie detector test determined you are telling the I truth. Told you, man. The test determined there was no secret affair with Amber. I am wrong, and I'm sorry for that. You I'm sorry. Right. But the test also determined that was a lie. <laughs> Gary has been cheating while Shanice is at work. That was a lie. <laughs> and has even spent Shanice's money on other women he's having sex with. Why? <laughs> you don't need him. You don't need him, man. You know we got you. Is it over? <laughs> I can't do this, Maury, no. Is it over? No, it's over. I don't want to be with him no. After the show with executive producer Paul Paul Haber. I, I messed up. You did mess up. You did mess up. I messed up. Gary first tried to save his relationship with the unusual approach of blaming Shanice. What are you doing? nagging at me, saying I'm messing with this person. Because you this are. Person. Because you're cheating. Exactly. But at the time, I wasn't doing it, but she made me do it. So no. all of her nagging pushed you in the arms yes, of another one. That doesn't sound so good. Exactly. She's been on top of you because you've been out there cheating. And she's suspicious because it's true. Mm -hmm. I felt it in my heart and I asked you to be honest to me and tell me. I apologize for cheating on you. I really do. And I promise I'm going to make it right if you give me a second chance. Will Gary's apology be enough to win Shanice back? <laughs> you, you, you're supposed to keep forgiving. What about me? I can't take no more of my heart, Gary. I really can't. And I'm sorry we had to end like this, but we are done. We are done. When we get home, you're getting your stuff and you're getting, you will not use me for another dollar. I promise that. So bye. It looks like Shanice is ready to move on from this relationship. I'm glad that this came out. It's better to find out the truth now than down the road. Yes. You're a good woman. You're beautiful. Thank you're you. smart. You have a wonderful personality. You're going to find a man that treats you right. No. You're going to find a man who loves you for who you are, not what you have. Thank you. Not what you, you know, not what you can do for them. Keep watching Mari for updates on Shanice in the future.